Good morning, folks. We're back today, Monday, back on the job. And today we're going to do a bit of plastering. So as you can see, we've stripped the wallpaper off the walls and ceilings in this room. And we're about to start skimming it. So today we're going to focus on the walls. Uh, we're going to do as much of the walls as we can. Um, we've got a bit of bonding as well because uh, when we took the wallpaper off, there was quite a few areas where the plaster was blown. So we had to dig that off, particularly in between the two windows. So we're going to apply some bonding first, let that set. And then we're going to try and do some skimming. We'll do the ceiling another day. We need to uh, put some spotlights in the ceiling as well. So that's the plan for today and we'll see how far we get on. So guys, hope you enjoy this video and we'll see you at the end. So what I'm doing right now is I'm just going to remove these radiators off the wall. Um, it's much better to remove the radiators if you can uh, before you skim so that you can, you know, get your plaster right behind the radiators. Also, we'll leave the radiators off until we finish the painting and then we'll put them back on as well. So that's why we are taking them off.
on a job this morning and today's job is going to be skimming again some more plastering so today you've got a large plastering job which is this ceiling um, this room is quite big it's about four and a half meters by almost four wide so good 12 square meters or more here um, so the plan is to cut out these um, lights for the spotlights in which we're going to have uh, 11 spotlights in this room and then we will be skimming the ceiling so that is the plan for today so guys hope you enjoyed this video if you do give us a like let us know what you think in the comment section how it's coming along and we will catch up with you at the end of the video take care
So guys, we're done for the day. As you can see, we've uh, skimmed the ceiling. We've cut out our holes for our lights. As you can see, we've got uh, four down here. Then we've got three down here. So there'll be one where that light is in the center there. And then another row on this side of four. So it's four, three, four, kind of staggered. Um, yeah, just cleaned all the edges out. Um, yeah, it's come out really good. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. It's Monday and we are back on the refurbishment job. So we're inside. Um, hope everyone has had a good weekend. And as you can see, our room is dried out nicely. So this is the master bedroom of the house. And today we're going to start painting this room. So what we'll be doing first is we're going to undercoat the walls and ceilings. And what we'll be doing is using a watered down um, white matte emulsion. So we're going to put about 30 to 40 percent water and stir it up, um, mix it. And that will be our first coat. Um, the plaster will uh, take a lot of the uh, the water from that paint and um, it will dry quite quickly. By the time we get around with a coat, we're pretty much ready to start a uh, first coat of white on the ceilings. Um, it's 21 degrees today, so it's quite warm. Uh, it's a lovely day. So that's what we're going to do. As you can see, I'm just uh, covering the wardrobes up so I don't get any paint on it. And then we're going to start painting. So the plan is today to undercoat all the walls in white, walls and ceilings. Then to give the upper area above the dado rail and ceiling two coats of white. And then we will also give it at least one coat of color. And then hopefully tomorrow give it the second coat. And tomorrow we'll also do all the woodwork as well which will be white satin wood. So guys, hope you like this video. If you haven't subscribed already to the channel, please subscribe and give us a like if you like us and uh, also comment, tell us what you think.
so right guys this is our uh, undercoat and um, now that we've done undercoat we can see that we've actually got some water stains here that have come through these would have been some stains that would have been in the old plaster and um, they've come through the new plaster which is often happens so as you can see i've got a sealer here um, this is a quick dry sealer it dries in about 20 minutes you can paint it in about 20 30 minutes over it and i'm just going to give it a light coat of this water stain blocker and that will stop the stain from coming through if you don't use anything like this and you have water stains you can paint it a hundred times and the water stain is going to keep coming through um, even if you've plastered over like we did uh, the stain can still come through so you do need to use a product like this um, so just giving it a coat there's two areas where we saw a stain and we're going to let it dry for about half an hour and then i'll come back to painting this first coat of white ceiling paint
so that's it for today guys this is the finished well not so finished we will be back tomorrow on this but we've given the ceilings uh two coats of white and as you can see the walls have had one coat of color so we'll be back tomorrow we'll do the second coat of color and then we will start doing the glossing of the woodwork so i hope you guys like this if you have please give us a like and we'll see you back tomorrow good morning welcome back today we are trying to finalize the painting in the master bedroom also plan to put the spotlights in as well so i've got a little survey so the customers decided that um she would like the top area painted in white uh, we discussed it before and um, my suggestion was to keep it white so what we said we will do it white and then let her sleep over it and see if she wanted to paint the top area so she decided she wants to put paint the top area the same color as the lower area so i said i'll throw it out there and see what people's uh, view on that design is uh, which one do you prefer personally obviously this is a, a personal taste choice um let us know in the comment section what you prefer white above the dado rail or the calico which is the type of brown color which you can see i'm painting right now so you'll see at the end what it looks like and you tell me which one is your preferred design so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, we'll catch up with you at the end
All right, guys, so this is the finished product. What do you think? So it's all painted. Um, we had to do a little bit of filling uh, around the center light when we removed the old light, um, but we will sand that down and paint that tomorrow. But this is the finished product. Um, we also have one more coat of the satin to do on all the woodwork, which we'll do tomorrow, and then we'll wrap up this room. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoy the transformation of the room. So we'll catch you tomorrow on another video. Take care.